Hi, in this video we're going to talk about a data flow diagram. Now a data flow diagram is a relative of the context diagram. The context diagram shows the entire system, whereas you will have multiple data flow diagrams and they show information that is passed between various parts of the system. Now you'll notice that this diagram here to my left actually has some bits missing in it and that's because it's from a classroom activity that we did, so I've left some of those for people to fill in but a proper one will of course have all of the things labelled. So the user is requesting a page, uh, they are putting it into this process called show all records and it is going to be going into the SQL database which is represented by that three-sided box. This is going to return the matching records with this process called display return records and that's going to give them the information that they've looked for. If we're looking up here, uh, the user, when they were searching for a particular record, then they would put in their search term. That would go into the process called uh, search for record. That would then put those search terms probably as a structured query into the database, which would then feed that out using that same process. Again, very useful when you're programming. If somebody's done all of these for you, or if you've done these for yourselves, then it's really clear to you what you're collecting from the user and what you're doing with that information and what you're required to give back.